Here is the race day recap of the nine races that took place at Hollywood Bet Scottsville on this chilly Monday afternoon. The first race was won by number 11, Bomber Girl, beating number 12, Mia Zathina, into second. Third was African Beat, and fourth was Averni Princess. Bomber Girl showed them a clean pair of heels. Piece. On the inside is African Beat. Coming down with about 300 metres to go now. Bomber Girl, Mia's Athena on the inside. Jane's Vision is still right there. African Beat is on the inside as they come down to the 200 metre marker. And it's Mia's Athena and Bomber Girl on the outside. Jane's Vision over the last 100. Bomber Girl's the leader though. Down the inside, Mia's Athena trying to come back for more. Bomber Girl's the leader though. And Bomber Girl will win it. Mia's Athena second, then African Beat. And on the the second race gave Tini Princely and Samanga Kamala a quick double. They won the race with Let the Flag Fly. Second was Icy Blast. Third was Yannickus. Fourth was Goosebumps and uh, Navajo Nation. Dead Eat it for fourth. But Yannickus is the horse to take out of the race from the Gary Rich Stable. Ran a very good race on debut. But Let the Flag Fly was the winner. Down to the 300, Icy Blast just the leader now, left the flag flies, trying to put on the pressure. These two have gone clear from Goosebumps, Yanakis on the inside. Let the flag fly has got Icy Blast under pressure past the 200. And let the flag fly now skips away. Let the flag fly going on to win by about three or four. Let the flag fly won at Icy Blast second, Yanakis third, close for fourth. The third race in the card was won by horse number... Uh, five Fibonacci from the Vaughan Marshall stable and uh, keep an eye out on the second horse Aberdeen coming from the clouds to run an absolute cracker. The outside of that is for sure. Coming on with 300 metres to go now. Fibonacci with the pink sleeves and cab. Winter Frolics under pressure down the inside. Common Grounds are still there. Behind that one, 99 euros. Running on is for sure. Galaxy Explorer is also trying to get into the race. It's wide open. Fibonacci, Common Grounds. Yes, for sure. The big run. Aberdeen coming with a late thrust on the inside. But it's Fibonacci from Aberdeen. Third place to four. Race four on the card was won by Trasova. From the Peter Musket stable, Sean Veal, the pilot. It was his birthday, Sean Veal, today, and he's had a wonderful day at the office. Trasova won, and in second was Power Star earning again for the connections. Drum still leads it. Imaginable down the inside of that power star. Trasova's running on. This is what it means. Gajama and Fana coming down to the 200 though. And it's flaming drum. Trasova, imaginable power stars on the inside over the last 100 though. The three of them across the track. Imaginable. Trasova and power star. There's nothing in it. They come down to the line. It goes to Trasova. Second to power The fifth race on the card looked to be a two horse race between Mythical Tune and Bosne and uh, Bosne had other ideas and uh, that's how they ran Bosne from Mythical Tune and uh, Bosne trained by Daryl Moore written to victory by Keegan DeMillo and owned by Preggy Sunasundrum Tune, the apple of my eye on the inside Adelante and clouds trying to get into the race La Dame Drapeau's on the outside still Bosne past the 200 from Mythical Tune St. Cloud is starting to warm up towards the outside but Bosne still goes past the 200 meter marker and it's Bosne going on from Mythical Tune at this stage and Bosne has won it Mythical Tune second third place will probably go to the the sixth race was won by Alpha Betty from the Peter Musket stable and Tristan Godden this uh, filly certainly looks to be one for the notebook and one that's on the upgrade. Go for a run towards the inside. Coming down to the 300 metre marker now. And it's family favourite from Fabulous. Lucky Miss. Kaylee needs some running room. Alphabet is also running on. Family favourite. Alphabet on the inside. Kaylee. Lucky Miss. Lady Serena. Over the last 100. They're coming from everywhere though. And on the inside. Alphabet. Kaylee. Lucky Miss on the outside. Alphabet won it. Second will go to Lucky Miss. Kay the seventh race on the card was won by another lofty raced horse that's seems to be on the upgrade also from the Peter Musket stable. Again, Tristan Godden. This is Aurora Storm. This gelding won a uh, good race, beating uh, Pirate Prince in second. Third was Professor Snape. Professor Snape, coming to the 400, release me, blazing kiss, exceed on the inside. Further back in the run is Aurora Storm. On the inside of Vernie King and Cyber Time as they come down to the 200. It's wide open, Aurora Storm on the inside. Release me, exceed her. Blazing kiss, Saku is trying to get into the race late. Aurora Storm, exceed her, release me, Pirate Prince. But Aurora Storm's going on. And it's Aurora Storm to win it. A wall of them for second. May 
baby part. The eighth race on the card, the penultimate race was won again by the Vaughan Marshall Stable, Sean Veal again. This is for Mr. Sugulam, and this is ensuing. That's won the penultimate event. Patronage with a good position. Give me a rainbow. Towards the outside, Putin's promise. Go, man, go. Cheeky laddie comes out for a run. That's the grey. Further back ensuing and towards the inside, Master Bling. Patronage, Winter Baron, Champampa, Champuzzi. Go, man, go. Ensuing, Cheeky laddie on the outside and Lord Wiley. But ensuing has taken it up. Ensuing, Champampa, Champuzzi. Patronage, go, man, go. But it's ensuing going on to win it. Second, go, man, go. Close for third, Cheeky. The last race in the card was a good race for the Gareth Van Zale stable. They finished first and second. The winner was La Pura Vida, second was Sharfalia. To go. La Pura Vida is the leader. Pelagonium's on the inside. Behind that, Harley's fate. Shafolia in the centre. And then comes Stingray. La Pura Vida, the leader. Shafolia's trying to chase it down over the last hundred. But La Pura Vida still goes. Shafolia's back in second. And then Stingray. And La Pura Vida will win. La Pura Vida will win it. The second place will go to Shafolia. Third place to Stingray. And fourth, Pelagonium. Well, that's a wrap of the nine races that took place here in the capital, Peter Maritzburg. Plenty of racing in KwaZulu Natal this week. We're here in the province again Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday. And we'll be looking forward to seeing you as usual from the number one box.